Fed Chair Jerome Powell and Treasury Secretary Steven Mnuchin testifying before Congress on economic recovery efforts. Edward Lawrence is live on what they had to say. It was a mouthful, wasn't it, Edward? Oh, it was. You know, in fact, yeah, that hearing is still going on, talking about the uh, House Financial Services Committee. Now, both, there was a lot of questions about the payroll protection program, and both Treasury Secretary Steven Mnuchin and uh, Federal Reserve Chairman Jerome Powell wore masks as they talked about transparency and money. And there is a, a live picture at that hearing. Now, under the payroll protection program, 4.8 million loans have been given out. We're talking about $520 billion dispersed. Now, about $135 billion will be left after today in the program. Today is the last day to apply for a loan. The Treasury Secretary says that he's already had conversations with the Small Business Administration and Congress to repurpose that money left over. Listen. There appears to be bipartisan support in the Senate to repurpose the $130 billion for PPP, extending it to businesses that are most hard hit, that have a requirement that uh, their revenues have dropped significantly, things like restaurants and hotels and others, where it is critical to get people back to work. Um, Mnuchin reiterated that negotiations on the next round of help through Congress will start in July. Democrats on the committee want to make sure that before that next round of talks starts, they want full transparency. That includes uh, what companies got the PPP loans. Listen. I cannot be able, in good sense, to make a determination as to where the program should go or what tweaks or what reforms the program needs, unless we have access to the data. And Mnuchin says that the data will be released by the end of the week, a source in the administration telling me that they are going to post it online with the Small Business Administration on Thursday, right before we go on the 4th of July holiday break. This is a reversal, of course, by the way, for the uh, Treasury Secretary. He was not going to release this information, but pressure from lawmakers, also threats of lawsuits for the Freedom of Information Act, uh, forced his hand on this. Charles? Yeah, we got to have full transparency on all of it. Edward, thank you very much.